Well, hello there. Good afternoon, good evening and good welcome to January the 1st, 2021. That sounds very strange to say. How are we? Um, it was a bit bonkers last night, I have to say. Fireworks going off all over the place. Um, there we go. I suppose people were celebrating uh, at home rather than at organised events. Um, I was in bed. Um, catching up on, I don't know, some true crime thing or other while I was trying to make notes about today's planning meeting um, and fell asleep while I was doing them. Uh, but yeah, so I um, had a planning meeting this morning of, for the Jar Jar concert so now we have more idea of what the plan is. I also think I'm going to tweak my um, choice of programme um yeah we will see so um i've been having a good old tootle thinking of changing a few pieces around but we shall see um yeah and we've decided that we're going to just record everything and then it's easy for just a button to be pressed to play and um, we can sort of introduce our pieces but um so that's the plan generally um i think so that's good that's all come together have ministry this morning I uh, had a Zoom, no, I had a Skype chat with someone and then just had uh, just had a, an hour out just watching, uh, I don't know, Police Interceptors or something. Was it Paddington? I can't remember. Um, and then thought I would film my vlog. Might go and do a bit of clarinet practice. And then my sister's organised a quiz. So um, it seems to be via a game app. So if I can download it, then I'll do that. Um, and then I've got to catch up with the girls tonight, so... Nice, fairly chilled, nice way to start um, um, a new year off. Um, yeah, um, so today's piece, I don't think I've played it before, but I may have. If I have, it was yonks ago. It's by um, Pietro Antonio Locatelli who was an Italian virtuoso violinist who gave concerts throughout Europe. And in 1729, he settled in Amsterdam, where he worked as a music teacher and director. He wrote many sonatas and concertos, whose style owes much to his great predecessors Corelli and Vivaldi. The allegro selected here is taken from the sixth of a set of 12 flute sonatas. Well, there you go, you live and learn, which are expertly written for the instrument. Might not be expertly played, but they're, they're, it's very nice. It's in the current, I think it's grade six syllabus. Um, it does need more work. Oh. Hmm. Something not quite right with that cup of tea. Hmm. Don't know what. Oh, I had coffee in it before, that's why. Well done, Lynn. Um... So yes, I'm going to leave the guide track on, um, purely because there's some there's a bit of timing that I sometimes get wrong, and if I lose the timing, then I'll lose it. So I'm going to leave that on for now. Um, but here we go. Hang on, let me uh, do that, and um, let's go for it. I'm going to my mouth. Oh, wrong, wrong place. Oh dear. <laughs>
sometimes when you press the red button, it all goes to hell in a handbasket. And other times, it goes really well. Um, I'll take that one, thank you very much. Um, anyone else that plays an instrument, do you find sometimes you have to force yourself to concentrate? Because you think, oh yes, I've played the bit that I, get, I normally get right, wrong, right. And then that's when it leads to more mistakes. Anyone else find that? Or is it just me? Um, sometimes I also have to make sure that I'm not looking too far ahead. Uh, sometimes I can read several bars ahead. How, I, how I've no idea. And um, get my fingers and brain all tied up in a knot. It's interesting playing an instrument. Um, I would certainly recommend it. If anyone has uh, had a new instrument over the festive period or is looking for a new challenge for the year, definitely have a go at learning an instrument. If it's something you've always wanted to do, have a go, is my words of wisdom for the year. Um, I didn't get a chance to sort out all the, um, the list of things that I was going to mention, so um, that, will be, that will be tomorrow's job, I think. Um, and I will try and log it. I found some of my list, so that's good. Um, that's always a bonus, isn't it? Um, so, oh, my hands are just thawing out. Great. Um, so yeah, I think I'll, I'm going to do a little bit more tootling, and then I'm just going to, yeah, chill for a bit before the quiz, and um, wherever else I might go and do a bit of clarinet practice. See if I can figure out what's wrong with my clarinet and um go from there so whatever whatever you're up to people hope you've had a a chilled day hope you can have a chilled evening and i'll see you tomorrow bye